Hello, people. My name is Rage, and welcome to the fastest footballist and furry, fair fur, furriest. Not the furriest. That's uh, these cars are not covered in. Feathers. What's your first owner? <laughs> Shall we not go there because we're going to offend people so fast? <laughs> it, it depends what you say. I guess what the answer is. Is is dragon allowed? Yeah, there's loads of dragons. Oh! Dra <laughs> yeah, dragons well, out your ears! Full of dragons! <laughs> full of dragons! <laughs> Either full way, guys! Dragons. Oh, by the way, before, before, of course, it happens, we have nothing against people who do that before. Because I just yeah. know. I just We're on the internet. I just know it's gonna. No, we're gonna say we don't have any, but the comments are gonna be a fucking laugh now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, play. really, what's a video that both you and me are in that doesn't involve some controversy in the comments? Yeah, but because so. I'm such a great person, everyone <laughs> just lives with it. Hello and welcome to Rocket League Tournament. Yes, indeed. We have the final game of round one, and a little birdie has told me that it's gonna be quite something, so I am excited. Was, it, what? was it a little birdie or a furry? <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, man. Little birdie or a big birdie or a big birdie in a suit? You're anyway. gonna get you're gonna get fired from the spot, man. You're gonna no, get I fired for controversy. No matter how good how good you're commentating, it's just it's not yeah. gonna fly with the officials. You know this. This is the last game of round one. This it is, is. Us, the finale of round Indeed. one. And we have then in the red team Traharis Beastie Hedgehog as the What's what's their name? Beastie Spaniards. Beastie Spaniards versus Cosmo Vortex and the Pink Panda as What's their name? The, the Flaming Earwigs. The Flaming Earwigs! So let's bloody do it! Uh, let's. I'm failing at using the menu properly because I am a moron. And we're away, team! We're Here away. We we're the away team. And I'm sorry for the disgustingness of showing my Steam overlay here. I know it's just. Oh my god. The worst. You're showing your Steam overlay? I know, I'm flashing everyone my Steam overlay. That's just. It's insulting. disgusting, isn't it? It's just just the worst thing. All I've right, as usual, I am bright yellow orange safety ref. Are you? I am blue ref. You are blue ref, indeed. So, here we go then. Who is your money on from team name alone? Well, this is a hard one to call because I haven't actually seen all of these people play. I Instantly, really thought though, it was Beastie already. Hedgehog is... Oh, ooh, a very He's quick back and forth. In front of it. It. Trajaris is just hovering, it seems, right now. Beastie Hedgehog is managing to get straight in there. Trajaris is staying in goal. He's very much just yes. sticking as a goalkeeper. And the blue team seems to be kicking out of there. They did a little bit of good defending there, but this is a very kind of... This is a very strong defensive tactic they've opened with. Oh, straight! Great it could have to waste, but no one was there. Cosmic Vortex was just hovering too far out to get the finish. Oh, we're having another go. We're having another go. It's right for the goal. the box. Oh. He picked it out. See, Cosmo Vortex, he doesn't seem to be on the ball right now. Aye. Uh, if he was paying a bit more attention, that could have easily been a goal. Twice, he could have stood <laughs> there and he kind of threw it away. Again, though, this is a, a strange opening because it normally is. the teams have got a bit defensive once the game Ooh. progressed a bit, once they're down or once they're up, but... They've gone straight for having a goalkeeper. This ball has spent more time in goal than a goalkeeper so far yeah. in this game. And you feel like that should be an easy thing to beat. Uh, and I don't know if the, I feel like if the blue team get a goal, then they've potentially well, won this. Yeah, they are very, very, very defensive. Although both of them are attacking the ball at the same time in the same way, which can't be sensible. But Trajaris is, he's staying on his line. He is playing in the same way we saw in the hollow uh, match where he was very much a goalkeeper. He did come out to the halfway line. He hovered there, whereas Trajaris is hitting it. Very good bounce for Orange here. And he's waiting. But there's no one to finish it up because he's not following up his own shots. He's, I think we might be looking at one of the lowest score games I'm so far. I'm thinking we will be looking at one of the lowest score games. I, but that means that every goal do. really matters. It does, it does. I think if blue get one goal, then they've won. And I think if orange get one goal, then they're close to winning. But if they get Oh, a lovely bicycle kick! And it scores! <laughs> that was a beautiful play from Beastie Hedgehog. A most beastly play. Look at this. That was a nice little chip over, and then he sinks it off the back of the panda. That's a it's sentence dumb. I never thought I'd say in my life. <laughs> 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 there, but he did manage to get the lucky second bounce and did push it in because he, he did, did 
I think it was Pink Panda got an epic save for that, or at least a save. So. He did indeed. So it was it was a return bounce, but I, the chip over both of them certainly yeah. deserved him that goal. I'm interested to see is because they've started so defensively. If they get maybe one or two more goals, whether Trajaris is going to explore off that line and see what's up, Ooh. or if he's just leaving it to Beastie Hedgehog. Because so far, Beastie Hedgehog, although that was a fantastic goal, he doesn't seem to be aiming too brightly. He seems to be hitting, hoofing, and hoping. Yeah. They do seem very content to let Beastie Hedgehog basically 1v2 for most of the game. It's, it's just kind of keeping the goal secure. And I think, you know, it, it's a good tactic. Is it there is. such a thing as too defensive? Yes. Because in, in this... Oh! Is a Lovely. Pink Panda sunk that very, very sublimely. It's because as soon as they're at your door and... As soon as they get past you, that's it. You're screwed. Yes. Whereas, that was a nice little bit of teamwork by Blue Team yeah. as well. Yeah. And if you get taken halfway up the pitch, for example, then you still have a little bit of leeway to get back, get your foot back in the door. Also. Oh, that was close. I found my new favorite thing to do in this game. What's your favorite thing to do in this game? Hold handbrake and spin in a circle. <laughs> well, I'm proud of you. <laughs> it's so much fun. <laughs> I see you on the pitch there. <laughs> yeah, that was just a spinning that near them. You see Hedgehog is bringing it around the box. See if Trajaris... So yeah, if Traharis had stepped out a little there, he could have sunk that. And now he does defend it, though. He does at least defend it. we just defending it. And I think if he pushed forward a little bit, if he explored his half and just his half and then was ready for that counter, they could have scored there. They could we have might scored end up it. seeing the first golden goal as well. Potentially. This seems to be evenly matched. Oh. Very a lot different. of misses there. A lot of misses. Lot and of again, one. right there, if yeah, Traharis exactly. had been there. If he had have pushed forward, if he had have seen the chance and attacked the space, that would have been a wonderful strike. But no, he's happy to just watch. He is happy to just watch. Maybe he's getting a cup of tea. We don't know. We he's don't know the player's minds. Down. We will get in contact with the mechanics. <laughs> uh, find out the report from pit side. Uh, but now <sighs> it seems to be very tame, almost. Uh, did oh. just you a little bit there. A little bit, yeah, but watch they got the players. Beastie, can he finish it? Oh, two very close shots and then a third, but a little bit further away. A wide. Oh, straight past it as well. Gives the blue team's chance to send it back up the pitch, but no, somehow Beastie is, like, man-moding both of them. He is, he is managing to take it around them, and I think they're a little bit puzzled by him on his own. Yeah, he's probably just throwing just them off a little bit. Yeah. Oh, Trajaris has come off his line. Hit the ball, first time all game. <laughs> He explored a little bit, and to be fair... Oh, you Beastie know, misses. Yeah. Oh, Pink Panda misses. Cosmo does, however, get it. Oh, Beastie's very good at dribbling, and he's Dribble. very good at changing the direction of the ball. But here's a perfect run-up. If Cosmo pushes forward now, he's going to. He's a bit too slow off the mark there. If he'd have got in the middle of Pink Pan Panda, not Panda. Pink Panda. The Pink Panther is on the pitch, everybody. <laughs> very good attack. Ooh. This might be it. This might be our golden goal. <laughs> Unless, nope, this is definitely golden goal. Unless, unless a spectacular it. goal goes in there. And no, oh, golden goal it is. So this is the first golden goal of the tournament, which is actually kind of amazing. It actually is, yeah. I, these are two verily, verily, verily even match teams. And, oh, it was a very quick golden goal almost. <laughs> Luckily, Trajaris does love sitting on that line. He, he probably does. Credit to him, he has defended most things that have come his way. He's pretty much, he's hovering on the white line like a coke addict. Oh, the Cosmo, he just wasn't there. Wasn't there. He's hesitating. It's not thinking. They seem to not be working. One team's struggling to create opportunities. The other one's struggling to cash in on them. Very apt. You're See? Getting... I'm, I did a thing. <laughs> I think the thing about the two teams is they seem to have tactics picked up. And I think they're too rigid with them. I think I think they're too rigid with their tactics. The game is fluid. The game is fast. And they're just not kind of playing to that. They're, they're saying, this is what we're going to do, and this will work. Cosmo will work. coming in for a big hit, and he misses it, giving Beastie this opportunity here. And oh, there's no one really in net. Whoa. He didn't quite utilize, utilize the speed there. He could have flipped forward. He could have pushed that even faster, even further out of the Blues' reach, and that would have gone in easily. But sadly, he didn't quite attack it right. Oh, and the first death as well. The second death. Oh, really? Yeah, that's the second time he's been killed. Oh. Uh, oh. Ooh. He didn't actually have to go for the save there, but I think he just wanted to get the points and show off a little bit. <laughs> Always was, a valid tactic in Rocket League. Panda had pushed forward. They just tackled each ooh. other. 
What's they're both oh. just kind of stopped and hitting each other on orange team. I think they're panicking a little bit with that one. See, the thing is about blue team, I think they are strongest and most likely to score when the ball is just outside of the orange area. Because that's when Trajaris... <sighs> if they both attack when they've lured Trajaris out of his goal, then they're going to have a much higher chance of actually bollocking oh, it. Oh, yes. Oh, but straight pass, but it's not on It's not on target. It's not on target. And again, he's on his own there. He's struggling to finish this because it's it very hard to set up and score by yourself in this game unless you have a lot of experience just doing oh, that. Oh, yes. It really, really is. We set up a 2v2 again, tournament. Again, we're heading near Traharis. Oh, and it's cleared. It's cleared very nicely. Oh, a solid hit from Cosmo there. This could Can Pink Panda do it? See, Cosmo oh, he goes for the fly and he fails. Was headed for the boost there. He completely removed himself. He set the ball up, put it in their area. And in my professional up. opinion here, both teams are playing not to lose instead of playing to win. Definitely true. Here we go, though. Oh, oh that was the opportunity of a lifetime there. The straight run at goal, and instead he decided he to try and run the ball. He miss chokes. It. Although there's Again. a good opportunity here as well, Just but it gets kicked out. Hit that at the halfway line, that would have been straight on goal. That would have been a beautiful shot, but instead, hes they're too determined to not get kicked out. Yeah, both teams are str- I mean, I could understand if this was the decider for progressing in the tournament, but there's two more games, potentially. Surely it's worth just going for it. See, Beastie Hedgehog, if you can get the finish, oh. just messes up. I feel like if blue team was... I think if nothing changes, orange is more likely to win here. They're getting yes. a lot more opportunities. And there's a rule from chance encounters. Ooh, there. Big Panda says no to Beastie there. Now, this would be a good chance for these two to push because, as you notice, Trajaris, it doesn't matter what Beastie Hedgehog's up to, he always pushes out when the ball comes close to his area. Ooh, and that, again, like, another close opportunity for Beastie. Well, this could go on for a while. Refs, oh, refs that. having a fight. <laughs> oh, here it might be it. It might be it. Oh, lovely save from Taharis. Down to the wire there. That was that was tense. A little scrap between the beast and the panda. See, panda bringing it across again. Cosmo Vortex is in the wrong place. To actually bounce off panda. The beastie misses it. This is an opportunity. Oh, but panda misses it as well. Back off the wall. And is, is he going to go over Cosmo? It is. It was going to. But he backed up. He backed up real good. Gonna go across the goal and nothing. Straight didn't get the finish on there. See, I think what these two teams are lacking now is Beastie Hedgehog just isn't a good enough outfield player to take on two players on his own. And at the same time, Trajaris is a good enough keeper to stop the blue team getting for it. Yeah, there's something, someone needs a change in tactics. Oh, oh actually, Beastie Hedgehog has got, oh no! no! That's his third fluffed open goal! <laughs> He's hitting himself right now. He has got to be feeling that. He has got it's to be feeling like he's letting his team down here. In defense of him, he is doing a 1v2 here. Jajaris have done two, three great saves, but that is 5% of an 100% match, and he has done fuck all for the rest of it. <laughs> the re composure being dropped for just a moment by one of the refs there. <laughs> Well, it's, it's honesty, you know, we're commentators, we're analysis, and we can say that Beast Hedgehog <laughs> is carrying the brunt of his team at the minute. He is, but maybe I, that's their tactic. Maybe they know where their strengths lie. Well, the thing is here, Pink Panda as well, he seems to be getting in the better positions. Cosmo Vortex, he seems to be more focused on getting those boosts and s maintaining his boosts. Well, rather from experience, the attractiveness of those boosts. There, again, the red team, Beastie Hedgehog, then just tackled Trajaris. There seems to not be much communication there. They've pretty much said, Trajaris, you sit on the line, you watch the goal, and I'm going to go out there and I'm going to knock it around. This is the longest golden goal I think I've ever seen in my history of Rocket League. I feel like we're not even halfway through if it continues at this pace. <laughs> it needs to be a kind of bold action from either teams. They're both hovering, neither of them are going for the finish. No one wants to commit, that's the issue. It's too long, and for some reason it's just also too dull. <laughs> uh, I think that needs to be oh, oh, is this what? it? Is this it? Can, oh my god! He had two separate attempts to just tap that in on the line! Is, I don't think we'll ever see a chance as easy as that in this tournament. That is unreal. A this should have been over seven ways to Sunday. A handful of easy chances and he's thrown away the easiest one. It's unbelievable there. Oh, to be a fly on the wall on the talks. It's both blue players against Traharis and again he defends them. I just, you know, it's it's 
and it's an inaccurate shooter against a brick wall at the moment. <laughs> it actually is. They do take it past Beastie again, but he's going to get to it. Beastie Hedgehog is there. He's very good at that sweeping tackle that he keeps doing, which is kind of protecting the, the center of their half and, and that general area before the box. This uh, is unreal. These, To be fair, though, but all four of these players have got to feel tense as hell right now. Yeah, I'm sure that they are literally shaking. <laughs> In their way. seats. Um, here Ooh, we a go. lovely, lovely right, touch there. Need to attack. Trajaris is out of his goal. He went for a challenge. Yes! There it is! Pink Panda sinks it! Pink Panda. Fantastic. See, look, Trajaris was out of his place. He was out of positioning. They Pink break Panda through Trajaris' defense. Over him. That was... That was long. That was a... That was... That was... I... Yes. <laughs> In the second words, game... Words don't describe what that was. In the second game, I'm hoping there's a bit more offensiveness and a bit more action. I well, think. they've fished each other out now, which is the which is the main deal. Let's see what happens in game two. Indeed. Let's do this thing. I think... Uh, I don't know. Honestly, I had Orange Team to win that. It does surprise me. It really does. I think they've got a tactic and they're sticking to it. A little bit too much. Uh, a little bit too I much. I think they've let their slime trails get everywhere. Yeah. They're not... They're not pushing the boat out enough. They're not trying things enough. Which, in, in a game like this, is it's a creative game. Although, that was oh. nearly a very quick opening goal from Beastie. That was very close. And that's what he does best, to be fair. Like, it, he seems to be very good at getting in the right place. He seems to be very good at being and uh, in, in positioning. But it's just not finishing. <laughs> and that's completely what he's lacking. And, you know... And oh, friends, again, though, that wasn't he, bad. He is fantastic at positioning, but if there was a better striker there, he could have converted six or seven in the last game alone. Yeah, that is true. That is true. There's a lot of near misses going on as well. See, Tradaris and Beastie Hedgehog almost tackled each other. Beastie's going to get on the end of that. He's just going to probably... Oh, no, he's going to turn away. I thought he could have pushed that down the wall a bit. There we go, though. Oh, a lovely overshot from Beastie. That was fantastic. Just after I com commented about how he's not finishing, he goes and puts a halfway line. <laughs> he heard you scream, he you what, mate? He answered me. He answered me which is good, actually, because that's what I want from the game. This may be our first game to go to all three games. Oh, my word! Oh. Harris, what? See, he leaves his goal. He gets a lucky hit. That is absurd. After. Blue team have to feel that. That was a very unfortunate double hit. The thing is, blue team came back from 1-0 down last time, and I have a feeling that they'll be able to come back at least a goal from this. I'm kind of hoping too, because it will open it up. There's a great chance. Oh! Wonderful save there from Traharis. I could he feel was... the no from blue team there as they knew that wasn't going in. That oh, was wait. close. This may be our first actual full played best of three. I'm kind of excited about that. Yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, are they evenly matched because both teams aren't that good? Or are they evenly matched because both teams are that good? I think they're evenly matched because one team has a very solid tactic um, and the other team is a bit more fluid. And okay. by a bit more fluid, I mean that they're good players. I think Beastie is better than the two players on the blue team. Um, and I think if Beastie was on the blue team working with one of those other fluid players, he would have scored a lot more today. But at the same time... Maybe some transfer drama needs to go on then. Th that would be funny. <laughs> they able to work together with the fluidity. They a nice flying shot as well there, but it didn't go in. No, they seem to be hitting and hoping. They seem to have the basic idea of one back, one forward. But they never seem to be watching what the other one's doing. They seem to be pointing away from each other, especially Cosmo Vortex. Seems to be looking away from Pink Panda for 80% of the game. Maybe they should invest in spinning. Maybe they should. Maybe they should be handbraking. And maybe they should be... I think Cosmo Vortex needs to get better at holding his boost. Oh, Traharis actually misses it for once. There's an opportunity for Blue. Oh, that was a very close... That could have gone either way very easily there. Indeed. Um, that was all down to the bounce. Uh, they're sending it back in, though. He's got to beat Traharis, but he's going in the opposite direction. They're both going for it straight up in the air again. See, Pink slightly Panda more favoured towards hovering, orange. But no one else is challenging for the ball. He misses it, though. Beastie Hedgehog. Oh, Beastie well. also missing it. And then Pink, Pink Panda. Panda. No! What is going This may be a terrible turn. Oh, Beastie misses it again! That was... 
I mean, uh, uh, that was absurd. And no, Traharis takes it. Both players see it. Both players see the opportunity, oh and Traharis sinks it. This goal gets a second, and that's kind of what I wanted him to do for the whole of last game. He needed to hit it down there, and he needed to follow it up. And now he's finally doing that. He's finding the back of the net. That is that is quite the turnaround. I feel like he's just growing in confidence the more that this happens. And that's good. It uh, is. He is he developing as a player right before our eyes, Fluke. He's, he's, you know, he needs to be able to embrace the fact that you can move forward into your, You can play goalkeeper, you can play defensive, but explore your but area. But I mean, if you're a blue team now, you got to at least feel good about the fact that you may... You, you're most likely losing this, but you're not out. Yeah, you have but, one more shot at this. Yeah, um, and, but I think the best mentality blue team can have at this point is... Let's try and win this game. Let's not of focus course, on what's yeah. happened. We're at nil-nil games-wise. Let's try and... But if I was blue team right now, I'd try some radical tactics just to see what goes through orange while they have the free time to do so. It, I wouldn't try that. No, oh, well, that's where we differ, you and I. We differ. I would... I think what they need to do is they need to buckle down a bit and they need to kind of... <laughs> oh, no! That shot there. Cosmo Vortex, if he was slightly further ahead, that would have been 3-1 very easily, but unfortunately, oh, yes. he, he fucked up. And then Beastie again, trying to take it past both of the blue players, and he's not doing a horrible job at doing so. In fact, in fact, he manages it. Uh, it looks like blue team has kind of let it slip a little bit now. That from was impressive from Beastie, though. See, the Beastie has found his feet, or blue team have lost theirs. They are just all over the shop defensively right now. I think they need a pep talk between Warrens. They need their manager to tell them straight. That's just going to bounce in front if anyone gets the follow-up to that, but no one went for it. See, Trujaris now, they're 4-0 up and there's a minute. Yeah, I, if I was him, I would be like, screw the goal. The I'm having some fun here. We can't lose. Uh, he's coming out a little bit and he does he actually take it round. It's like he was literally listening to us. And then can Beastie <laughs> sink this? No, was there. I thought he was going to miss that for a second based on he seemed to be Yellow ref saying hi to Traharis as it currently stands. Just, just giving him a nice love tap there. Well, you almost hit the ball there, yellow ref. <laughs> yellow ref knows what yellow ref's doing. Yellow ref <laughs> is going to be banned soon. Oh, blue team take it over. They might get a pride goal. They might get a pride goal and they... What? They do. They do. That was, that was painful if that had not gone in. Across the front of goal. That was... Oh, look at that. Look at that. The saving by Beastie Hedgehog that went wrong, but could have been even worse, surprisingly. Fortunately, it matters not, though, because this is 100% going to game three here. Uh, we do not do goals for and goals against. They're just tracked as the stats for who we will find out who the man of the tournament is. Indeed. And we'll uh, find out who the team of the tournament is as well, because it might not actually be the winners. It might not. The two best players will, I hopefully assume. Oh, that was going in 100% as well. Well so, then, the first third game... That was a very convincing win. Yeah, that. and it didn't go to goal and goal half the time, in fact, of the previous game. So maybe both teams are getting into this a little bit more. I'm hoping so, and I'm hoping Trujaris again explores the space. I'm hoping he doesn't retreat back now, because now it is one all, now it is the next one wins. I'm hoping... <laughs> Let's do that again from Trujaris. <laughs> yeah. Well, let's go to it then. I'm excited. I'm very, very excited. I have no idea who I would put my money on now. I think Orange team have the edge. I think they've overall done better across both games, but it's close. Gonna... Oh, I guess we're going to find out. That we are. Right. Now, Beastie Hedgehog seems to have a knack for getting into those early and seems to be able to take those very well, the kickoffs. And it's quite a skill. I know we haven't actually mentioned it at this point. And there is obviously the luck of the draw with kickoffs. Uh, where if you are going against someone who's closer or further away or an angle, then it becomes a bit of an issue. But if you can learn to predict how oh, you're... Oh, blue team. They've got an opportunity here. Trujaris Both miss. A player out there. I have a feeling irrelevant of the final score, the first goal in this match is going to be by far the most important. Yeah, and I'm. it could also be very long to the first goal. It could. Uh, I think that the blue team's going to kick up their defense a little bit, or I hope they kick up their defense a little bit, because last game they just let it drop. They just kind of flailed. And you can see Cosmo now is hovering, and he's waiting to pick up those side balls. He's still, he's not really reversing too much, which is quite a problem. He seems to drive in straight oh. lines. He does manage to stop Beastie there, though. No, but playing this game with blinkers is generally very bad for your health, your heart, and your scoreline. 
<laughs> in that order. Yeah. Oh, cross go. goal, though. Can anyone finish, finish it? Cosmo's here for the follow-up, but he goes oh, surely way this too late. Is in. And then BC this, no. sees the opportunity. There was no missing that. And that there was, it is. That was a very good takeout. And that is unfortunate. It's Bash Bosh. He does very succinctly put it over the blue player there, though. Yep, that was a wonderful take. He's very good in that area. He seems to be very good at tracking back and defending that... Uh, just the tip of the first third. Just the tip. Okay. Just the tip. <laughs> he's, a, he's a sweeper. This is... Ooh, lucky that Beastie Hedgehog was pointed the wrong way there and Trajaris was playing defensively. Beastie Hedgehog almost took it past Trajaris. He seems to just tackle his own player there. Can Blue Team get the equalizer? They've got to be desperate for it. The thing is, at this point, although they're both orange and although they're both oh. shooting the same way... Ooh, death often, happening there to stop that from going in. Often feels like Beastie Hedgehog and Trajaris are on different teams. Ooh, that was very, very close from Beastie. Because the way Hedgehog is playing now is he's playing his game, and then even if he gets close, it seems both him and Trajaris challenge for the same ball, but just hitting it the same way. See? Both oh are no! I got Trajaris. He has got to feel that one. What a disaster! They both thought each other had it. They both move out the way. Trajaris just. Oh no! Yeah. Oh lag. no! They were getting claims of lag. They do. Wow, his ping is at 200. They have been playing like that the entire way, though. So I mean, extra credit to them. It's impressive. Yeah. I, but that was. You've got to. You've got to feel bad about that. that you. Was too perfect. Oh, but Beastie immediately gets their lead back. He wanted his pride back from that. Oh, he did. He fought like a rabbit. And this was beautiful as well. A nice little touch here, and that's all it takes. A little bit late from the tackle there on Cosmo. Didn't quite predict it well enough. I mean, if they went on to lose that in golden goal after that kind of failure to save, I mean, you've got to retire from Rocket League. I would definitely think there would be some kind of penance paid. <laughs> uh, you know, they're paid at the Holy Royal, uh, Holy Rocket League altars. Um, that is true. Maybe a sacrifice of rocket fuel. Maybe. Um, again, it's just hovering in that corner there. No one's really hitting it convincingly. Beastie Hedgehog has taken it down. If he angles this Oh, right, no. Maybe the Pink Panda has decided that, you know what? Uh, if we can't beat Beastie, we'll just remove him as an object. Well, it is a very good tactic. It is. Defending. If you're attacking, it's not that great. Oh, the chip <laughs> over him and in it goes. This is still anybody's game. This is exactly how I wanted this last game to go. Both teams are going for it. Both teams are getting goals. This, this is, is... I can't, again, I still, two minutes in of the third game and I still can't call it. It seems Trudiris has fallen off from his first yes. game. A couple of epic saves earlier. I think the mental fortitude is slipping. It's got to be after this long, though. I mean, that golden goal will have taken it out of anyone. Yeah, the thing is, though, if he pushed forward a bit and put a bit more pressure on the blue team when they get closer, he would defend a lot more. Oh, oh that oh. has got to hurt. Really close. That has got to hurt, though. But if he, he needs to apply the pressure. He needs to close down blue team and not let them come to him. Because if he goes to them, the goal, goal is a lot smaller to score in. But if he lets them come to him, then he is tiny compared to that goal. That is true. Oh, if, it's going across again and again. Traharis misses it on the first time, but he does redeem so himself. The thing is, Cosmo is never there to really pick up that second yeah, shot. I think Cosmo needs to be a lot more aggressive with this. They've seen that they can break him now. And not to point at other people in the tournament and say they would do it well, but I think the trash men do that pretty well. Yes. I also think if Beastie were minion... There'd probably be a lot more times where yep. goals get sunk in. Definitely, definitely. Um, you know, and but it's easy to compare it to yeah, other players. Yeah, it very much is. And that was a lovely goal. That was that just a lovely goal. He was shutting you up. He was shutting me up pretty hard there. He heard what I was saying. As he flapped his face Cosmo, into Cosmo, though, was in every position to save that. It's the biggest draw for Cosmo at the minute is his position, is, is how he's playing uh, the space of the game. If that goes... Oh! Oh, off the line! That was... I think Orange Team might have just done it with that. I think that might be the ceiling. Smo tried to predict. Pink Panda just let it drift to him. That if has got a sting. I mean, 3-2 a minute, you've got a chance you can go for it. But two goals behind, you're kind of being defeated now. Oh, if Beastie misses this. That would have been, that would have been a turn up. It's still possible, I think, and I hope it's possible. If they sink, if Orange Team sink another oh. one, he... Oh! 
Thought it was close. Oh no, but Beastie's <laughs> there! He finishes it! I got it. I think okay. now I think now Beast. you It's an uphill battle. It from is. Here. You, you know it's, that it's, there is a low I, chance that you bring in this see, home. Both kind of flailed a little there. They didn't they didn't hesitate. They wanted they were desperate and fair enough they were desperate to get a third goal there, but it cost them. It cost them more than they probably bargained for. Place in the tournament, oh, potentially. Been positioned for another perfect goal there. Oh, 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 just a little bit too fast, a little bit too quick. Can they I at least get another pride goal? That's the thing. Maybe they might still get three goals. Uh, we have a good 40 seconds left in the game. Well, Cosmo takes it past Priesty pretty handedly, and both of them are being quite aggressive now. They know it's they know it's all or nothing time. And he gets round to Harris, but is anyone there to finish it? No, no Beastie picking up slack. 30 seconds. I'm pretty safe in saying that the blue team have lost this now. It they is. might get a goal. They would be lucky to. It would have to be off a big counter. But I think congratulations to uh, the beastie Spaniards. I know. I think they have definitely sunk this one. Yellow ref is uh, content to say hello to Traharis. Oh, and oh, there we oh, yellow ref didn't get a touch in all game. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> and there we have it, everybody. Commiserations to Blue Team. Congratulations to Orange Team. They progress to face us. Us? Well, I guess. What we'll are we thinking? Um, I don't know. Really? I mean, if they stick to that tactic, it could go either way. Beastly Hedgehog got a lot of lucky ends and a lucky finishes, but luck's all part of it and I guess we'll just have to see. Indeed, I for one am kind of pumped though. So there you go everybody that is the first uh, four games of the tournament complete. We should now see some pretty ferocious action here in Rocket League. Remember to like you've enjoyed this goodbye fellow fluke. Fellow fluke yes, I am also fluke <laughs> Everybody is fluke Yay! And oh, everybody good. is fursona. <laughs> oh, just tying it together God damn it. Oh good boy <laughs>